today on Mysterious Writings, the story of a lost treasure, the stolen Atosha Star Emerald, and the Golden Eagle of the world's greatest treasure hunt. Stay tuned. In 2012, an armchair treasure hunt was launched with great expectations. It was entitled The World's Greatest Treasure Hunt, Quest for the Golden Eagle. This hunt was created by Ron Shore with the main purpose to raise money for breast cancer research. It didn't at all go as planned. As the title described, it was to be the world's greatest treasure hunt, a hunt which would reward 13 prizes, 12 silver eagles, and the final prize valued at $1 million. This was the Golden Eagle statuette, which held the historic 400-year-old Atosha Star Emerald in its base. Sales of the books and enthusiasm for the hunt didn't reach the lofty levels first envisioned. Ron, however, kept on in hopes it would turn around. Five of the Silver Eagles were rewarded, but in 2016, an additional obstacle dug its claws into the hunt and tore it apart. The Golden Eagle statuette with the Atosha Star Emerald was stolen. It remains missing still today. The theft was given as one of the main reasons that in July of 2018, Ron Shore released a statement that the world's greatest treasure hunt had to be placed on hold. Although Shore had insurance on the Eagle, the insurance company refused to pay out for believed violations to policy conditions. So until all is sorted out, if it ever will be, the hunt will be at a standstill. While many of the events surrounding this situation, the hunt and the robbery, continue to be questioned, some involved in the hunt suggested a possible planned robbery, which Ron vehemently denies. One thing is known for certain. The Golden Eagle with the Atosha Star Emerald is missing. It was reported to be stolen on May 29th of 2016 after one of Ron Shore's promotional treasure hunt events in Ladner, British Columbia. The investigation remains open and no one has come forth with any solid evidence leading to the discovery of this stolen eagle with its historic jewel. It disappeared soon after being on public display at an art expedition in Vancouver for four days. At the time of the theft, it was still in transit back to a secure location. It was in Ron Shore's backpack. Ron had spoken at an event the Sunday evening of the robbery, and according to Shore, as he was walking out to his car after that event, he was robbed by two masked men. The two men grabbed the backpack with the eagle and sped away in a vehicle. The golden eagle hasn't been seen since. Where it is today remains a mystery. This stolen treasure was an incredibly and beautiful golden eagle crafted by Kevin Peters. The head of the eagle is encrusted with 763 diamonds. The eagle's eyes are said to hold two 1.1 carat pear-shaped diamonds. And of course, besides being made of varying amounts of gold, the eagle at its base held one of the most precious stones of history, the Atosha Star Emerald. In 1992, this emerald was valued at $250,000. It is probably worth much more today, as it is one of the largest cut emeralds from the Atosha. The Atosha was a Spanish galleon which sank off the Florida Keys in September 1622. This shipwreck held a lost treasure of immense value and has a story all of its own. But for this story, the sunken treasure of the Atosha was discovered by Mel Fisher and crew in 1985. The Star Emerald was only one of the famously discovered treasures of the ship. It is believed the Atosha was carrying around 70 pounds of emeralds, which less than 10 pounds have been recovered to date. The galleon was also believed to have over 40 tons of gold and silver on board. Only portions of this treasure have been recovered as well. And unfortunately, the Atosha Star Emerald has been lost again with this robbery. What a tragedy. Will this amazing lost historic treasure be rediscovered once more? Time will tell. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time here at Mysterious Writings as we continue to talk about all things treasure.